it's Monkey 1000 and today I have my mother with me. She didn't really want to be on camera so I'm not going to put her on camera too much. So we're going to make a Valentine wreath. Now they have, I bought most of this stuff a year ago at Dollar Tree and they didn't at the time, they had a heart one that I was going to do but they didn't have them when I went back so I got this round one. So we're going to use the round one instead and it'll be fine. And I got uh, a couple of these I'm going to try to weave in and out of this so then it's all covered so you don't have to paint it. And I have a bunch of flowers here that I have had over a year now because by the time I got everything together and thought about it, Valentine's Day was over. So I figured I'd do it this year. So I got those, a bunch of those, and we're going to take them and glue them all the way around and stuff like that. I also have this little plaque here, which I'm going to use some of this to put on here, about right about here in the bottom here, as you can see, hopefully you can see that without my hands here. Look, so it'll be like that and I'm going to wire them in there. And I'm also, I'm going to try, I don't know if this is going to work or not, but I wanted to use this. This came from my lights from the um, jars that I use for my candles for outside. And I had an extra one because I think the jar broke. So I think that's why I ended up with this. So I was going to try, this is solar. So I was going to try if these will work, is weave it in and out of here on the reef here. So it, the sun will catch it during the day, maybe, and um, maybe it'll be lit up at nighttime. That would be pretty if I can get it to work. So anyways, we got the glue gun heating up and I also got some rhythm, ribbon here that we may try to make bows if we get lucky. <laughs> so. <laughs> Yeah, so we're going to try this out. I'm trying my new mic out today and I got my camera going. So yeah, I really like it. So here we go. We're going to bring you down and bring you closer where you can see and you'll be able to see what we're doing here. So I got her tried to help me. I'd like her to try to make some bows if she can for me because I really suck at it. You suck at it. I suck at it. So anyways, we were going to try, try to do a little bit of everything and kind of make it pretty, you know. So what I'm going to try to do is weave it first with this stuff. And this, I never really, I thought it would look pretty, you know, weaving it. Sparkly, isn't it? Yeah, it's sparkly. It's for Valentine's Day. Um, or you could use it for Christmas or whatever. It is very thick. So I might have to cut it and weave it. I don't know. So I'm going to try to weave this and see how we can do this because I think, see, I had a, I watched a video once of somebody do, using this stuff and, and all she did was weave it and she made it look so easy. They all do. So I was just kind of seeing if we can do this. So I'm going to try to figure it out first and um, I'll come back. Okay guys, what I was trying to do here is I was showing you um, how I was going to weave it. I was tight on the weaving uh, and then I decided just to loop the, the wide part through the wreath as you can see later on. Um, my mic was not working at the time so that's why I'm doing it over. But it, it gets better. Stay tuned. What I did instead of, hopefully you can hear me, instead of um, doing what I was doing, it, it was just too small what I was doing. Yep. Detected. I'll be back. Oh. I have therapy here coming here for my mom. I'll be back. Yeah, we've got a trying. project going. We've got a project going. We're trying. We're not very good at projects. I think you guys are great at it if they just leave you alone. Yeah, right. <laughs> well, I'm tired now. Yeah. I hope she doesn't show up. Well, hey. Okay. Bye. Oh, you're leaving? Yeah. Okay. Bye. Bye, Mom. I'm hooking up here, maybe. This thing's dying, so. Okay, guys. 
All right, so sorry about that. We had therapy for my mother come in today. So anyways, this is what I've come up with. Um, what I did, I just, instead of making it tiny like I was showing you, I raveled it up in and out, which is a lot easier. I burnt my finger, but you know how it goes, right? So anyways, that's what I would do is just take it and wind it all the way around. So instead of doing it the way I was first doing it. So now we got this part done. We are going to uh, probably put this in. Okay, so hopefully you can see this. I think you can. Yeah. Um, we're going to open this up and I will put this on. And what I'm going to do is hook it through and use these. I also use those instead of the glue because I really was burning my hands bad. I used it here to... Um, as you can see right here to, to you know hold it better um, the glue wasn't really working it was making a mess so I wasn't too happy with it so um, live and learn right so I'm gonna open this up and we're gonna get this going here okay now, I wanted to paint it white, but she said to leave it. Well, I don't think the paint will stick to it because of it, what it's made of. It may, it may not. It's, people paint them all the time. But anyway, so I'm going to put it down here, I think. Maybe, maybe turn it like this. So then that, where the attachment is, is kind of like that. So we're going to put love there. And I think that'll look cute, don't you? Uh-huh. Talking to you. Sorry. So, I'm just going to use these. And uh, Shaver had red ones, so that kind of works good. So, we're just going to hook these through here. Hook them long enough. Yeah, they're fine. You don't need them real big. No. These are tiny. Fine. And just hook them. The only problem is you're going to see that. I don't like that. So, maybe I can hook them, weave them the other way. So I'm going to try to weave it somehow through the back and then we'll come back and I'll show you. So I'll be back. Okay guys, so Shavers found me some tape because I was going to use these. If I tie this through through here, you're going to have this, which I don't know if you can see that or not. You're going um, to have it hanging like that so uh, that doesn't look pretty so anyways we got two way sticky tape got two way sticky tape so we're going to try to put it on the back if it's that thing's pretty heavy though I I'm gonna put it here hopefully this will work and go to the mesh if it doesn't, we'll have to do it the other way, but I really don't want to do it that way if we don't have to. And we can put it like that and see it shows it blends in because it's the same color. So that would might work. As long as it sticks, we'll be good. So, so then you take this part and, peel. and you're going to peel it if I can get it going. Takes a few minutes here. Alright, so we got it. We got it. So there you go. And hopefully we can kind of center it the best you want or can. And hopefully it'll stay there. Is that straight? Yes, it's straight. Good. That's surprising for you and me. Getting this so, straight. <laughs> okay, so that works good because I didn't really want to hook the hoop. So hopefully it'll stay on there and not come off. So, and the crazy glue, I mean the glue, hot glue gun is just messy. It's just really messy for this project. So, now what I want to do, we're going to go and start the flowers. So, we're going to do flowers around here so all the flowers she's got these flowers together she's I don't know what she's trying to do 
Um, I want to see how the colors blend. They look so nice. what you want to do is you're going to take them off. You're not going to have it and stick this in. You're going to take them off and you're going to put them wherever you want. So we're going to cut them. And I'm going to I'm going to keep them long for first to see how far they can go in. And I might need some uh, cutters from Shea Bear. That, oh, there you go. Okay. And you just cut it off. And poke it through. And you're going to poke it through the holes, hopefully. And just play with it and weave it blank. Yeah. And you can do whatever you want, you know. You just kind of weave it in and put a flower fluff there. It around. Yep. And just fluff it around. So then let's say we want a heart. I'm going to put a heart on this side. So you might not have to, um, you know, you don't have to, you can cut them to whatever size you want. I mean, it depends where you're putting it and how you're putting it and, and stuff like that. So I'm going to do a few of these with you and then I'll turn you off and then I will do it the rest because you get the idea. And with these, you can move them around too. See, you could kind of play with it here. And you can poke them through if you want, but you know, you don't want to poke them through too much because then when you put it on the door, it's going to be um, sitting out. It's, yeah, yeah, it's going to stick out. Yeah. So maybe I'll do it like this way, like I did that one. Yes, I think that's a good idea. And then that way, there. And then it can just kind of sit like that. You know. You see? Mm -hmm. You like that? Yeah. And I could put one uh, under here. Yeah, to hold that up. Yeah, that'll be a flower. Yeah. yeah, put a flower, like let's say a red one. You want a red one? Yeah, so we'll take a red one here. And just put a red one up here, uh, right in here, so we can do that. Um, I don't really, you don't really need to have these leaves. I mean, not all of them. No. no, you can you can cut them up shorter, and I probably will with this one because I got a leaf on the other one. You don't want all that leaf, I don't think. So everybody depends on what they want to do with it. So then you could kind of. Poke it in here, and it's probably going to disturb that stuff that I put underneath there, kind of like that. And they'll stay. I think they'll stay. And you can play with them, see? Yeah, that's better. Yeah, just kind of put it like that, because you're going to have it hanging. Mm. Well, I could put another one here, too. Yeah, there you go. Just got to play with it and fix the leaves on this one. There. Yeah. See? Cool. It'll look better once you get the whole thing done. Well, of course. So, anyways, you got the idea, you know, and I got all kinds here. I got some baby breath here. I'm going to cut, cut some of this baby breath, put in between these right here, too. I hope you're seeing this because my watch, it died on me, so I can't use it. Yeah, let me see if it'll come back on. It needs to be charged. So, that kind of gives you an idea. So, I'm going to do the rest of it, and, and then I will come back. So, stay tuned. Okay, guys. So, I'm just trying to show you what we kind of got together so far. Um, yeah. So I put a little bit of baby's breath there to kind of give it a little bit more color. And we got the, she wanted to bunch them up, so we bunched them up up there. They're, they're hard to poke through here and they don't want to like lay down, but that's okay because it's going to be hanging. I'm going to take some rope and I'm going to hang it. So um, and you it, don't have a screen door to worry about. No, I don't have. Some people might. No, I don't. So it depends on what they've got. Right, so front door. I'm going to take some of these and I'm going to put them and fill them up in through here. 
I don't know. I, I don't think I want to put them too tight. Just put a few more in and I don't know. We'll see. I'll, I'll see. I don't want to bunch it up too much, you know, but we'll, we'll be back as soon as I get some more done. Okay guys, so I'm kind of showing you what I've accomplished so far. Um, she made a bow, a little bow here. She, she did a good job. I'm going to use this two-way sticky stuff instead of the crazy glue. Um, this is good stuff. And I'm going to kind of put it up like that. So then the hearts are kind of together like that. How's that look? Yeah, it looks good. good. Now we kind of want to make sure it's even because you have your love down here on the bottom here. Uh, hopefully you can see that. And uh, we'll do that. So I'm going to put this on here for right now. And we'll try to get the two-way off. I cut it as close as I could. I'll cut it a little bit more so it's closer and it's high hidden from the bow. I just thought maybe this might work better than trying to burn my hands with a hot glue gun because I just took off half my finger, the skin off of it, so yeah, not good. I like glue guns, but they're no fun when you get burnt. So, and you just take this paper off and hopefully I can get it to work and get it going here. And what I'm doing with the flowers, I'm just cutting them cutting them off the thing and poking them through the holes as best as I can. Um, you know, and they're going to go up here and they're going to go up, up up there. So hopefully that'll look pretty good. Yeah. So there we go. So hopefully we'll get this done soon and you can see the results. But this takes a little time getting this tape off. It takes a little time trying to cut and try to try to uh, um, cut it and all that crap so it's a little, a little time consuming but it's a fun activity to do because it's cold outside we really can't do much outside the sun is out today but it's only like in the 60s and we're not used to that not, not when you're used to 90 most of the year well our thing is we don't need to be outside and get our immunity sick and to the point where we catch a cold and then we're in trouble with the virus so we don't want to do that so we're doing this right now and she's had some therapy today and nurse is coming again so because she has a problem with her foot so we're trying to fix that I can't get this. So anyways, I'm going to take this off and I'll put the bow on and I'll be back. Okay guys, so this is where we gotten it to so far. We put the little bow here and these are here. They're very loose. I mean, you could glue them if you want, but to me that's just going to make a big mess with the glue. Um, you know, you just got to play with them and put them in there and bend them. Just don't make them too short when you're cutting them because if you do that, then you're not going to get them in. You know, with the heart, I had this one right here, the pink one, and it's a little loose and it's shorter than the rest of them. But it wouldn't go in for me, so I, I had to kind of play with it. And she's trying to put that there. So you just kind of play with them. And as you bunch them together, they're all going to get together and, you know, they're going to kind of stay together. So they'll stay in there, I think, pretty good. Yeah. So she's trying to, I don't know what she's doing. Can't find a hole. Well, I'll do it. So um, I'm going to put some of the white in here a little bit. So you see, I just weaved it through that hole. Now you can bring it up if it's small enough, or you can just poke it in there like so. And just blend it in. No biggie. No biggie. So that's how you do that. So it's not too bad. I got working on this one pretty good. Um, I'm going to get her to cut me some stuff. I need some red. What? Red what? Red one because this is pink. So I'm going to do need this one. Heart? I'm going to put, well, I did. So I'm just poking it in there. 
And she's going to cut it for me. There, you got red hearts right beside you. Here's one. Or is that pink? Oh, that's okay. red. And you're just going to poke them in, but don't don't make your stu your um, stems stems too small because if you do, they're just going to fall out. And I'm not, you know, these are just kind of got to play with them, just like so, you know. So um, yeah, and then over here, I'm just going to poke here. <coughs> um, kind of should bring this over here and do it like this. So it just kind of blends in, you know, make it your own. You do your own thing and it's what you like and what you think it looks nice. So, and I'm not an expert at this. I don't claim to be. Um, no. I just do it for fun because I have fun with it and that's it. So, and it's not, it doesn't have to be perfect. Nothing has to be perfect. Okay, so now that I got a red here and I got this pink here, I'm going to put another pink one probably in through here. So I'll put it in between the two reds. Probably that's what I'm going to do. So I'll get this done. It's time consuming, but it's a good, good thing to do if it's a rainy day or if it's cold like it is right now. Yeah. It's, it's nice to have something to do that makes you proud of what you get done. And the thing is, I'd rather make my stem longer than shorter because if you want to, you can always cut it shorter. Later. It so if out. you don't like it or you, it doesn't fit where you want it to go. Because they have a mind of their own. So I uh, just poke them off like that. I'm using scissors, but you could use um, cutters, you know, if you have them. So, we're being lazy. No, I'm not being lazy. It's what I have. So, and I just kind of put it, poke it in there, and poke these in there, just like so, kind of. Because you got to remember, you're hanging it, so it's going to all be showing. See, see how it's that? Really pretty. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, it's getting to be look real nice. What? It takes time. You gotta fill it in to, for it to get the effect of it. You know? Right, right. Yeah. And these are all gonna get in here. So I didn't. You really just poke them in. I mean, some people I think what they do is take them off and they glue them and they wire them. I'm not doing that. I'm just gonna poke them in there and hopefully they'll stay. They'll stay. Now there is a wire in there from the wreath so I kind of try to loop them around it so then they they'll stay a little bit better but um, yeah I think it looks pretty yep so I need a pink heart pink heart yeah I'm on a pink heart mm -hmm. you can give me that pink no give me this pink this pink right here yeah so I'm going to show you what she's doing here with hers there you go yeah, hopefully you're seeing that because I don't know. I could try my phone, I guess, because the battery went on this. So let me try to, I can hook up the phone and see. Okay, so, uh, yeah, so, I mean, it's a fun thing to do. to play with it to get it off but if you have cutters use cutters it makes life a little easier I mean I'm kind of making it harder mm. watch your fingers you only go so so far and then you just bend it and twist it until it breaks that's all I'm doing No problem. These are shorter, these ones, so it makes it a little harder to put them in. Um, but I'm hoping to put this in. And now I can move you over here so you can see a little bit better. Yeah. 
and I'm going to just poke it in here. This is different than that one and they have red ones so I'm going to put them in and I'm kind of just turning it around slowly and I'm going to poke it in here so you can see what I'm doing a little bit better. And you just play with it because you got to get it through these holes. And these holes are very tiny. And you got to pick one, you know, just and hopefully it'll go in there <laughs> and pray. So, yeah. Oh. This one's hard because it's so short that it's a different color. There you go. See? There you go. So you just got to play with it. Just takes time. And, and you can see how I'm doing that and how it looks when once it's hanging. That's the way it'll hang. Oops, I heard. Let me bring you up. Yeah, so there. That's how it's going to hang like that. So I'm going to do up here and then I'm going to do the other side. And then I'll come back and I'll show you what I got done. Okay guys, so now this is our end product. This is what we got. We had to play with them a little bit, you know. I think I got a little too much over here, but we kind of evened it out the best we could, I think. Um, we're running out of flowers and stuff. So I could put a pink one maybe right here. Let's see? That would probably yeah, you work. Can look and you fluff and you can change your mind. So all there, the time. I think that looks good. So now what we're going to do is make the rope. So I got stuff here, as you can see, and I don't know how much it is, but we're going to just loop it around, and you make it as high as you want, whatever you like. I think that'll probably be enough, huh? Yeah. Depends on where it's gonna hang on the door. So, um, no, it'll be fine. If the problem is, is where am I gonna put it to hang it, like to hook it? So maybe like do it through here, <coughs> because you want to be able to see the hearts and the little bow that she made. So you want to do that. So I'm just gonna cut this off, probably to there. And we can just make it the way we want. You know, you can probably adjust it too, you know? Because you can cut this stuff and it's wiry that's, and stuff like that. So I'm just going to. That's what it's good about sticking through the holes and not gluing it, is you can change it. Well, I'm it's not talking. You'd be stuck with it. I'm not talking about the hearts. I'm talking about. And if you want to just tie it, you could tie it. You want a crazy glue. I mean, crazy glue. If you want it, you know, just just do a loop in it, and then that way, because I have one of those uh, hook things that you can do. Yeah. You know, um, uh, hopefully you're seeing this, and I can just put it through here. Um, hopefully you're seeing this. Hold on, let me make sure you're seeing this, so you know what I'm doing here. And here we go. I'm going to turn my phone on so I can tell. You know, I mean, this might be too long, you know. I might have to make it a little bit lower and cut some more off. And, uh, and here we go. It's just like that. So, kind of looks good. How do you think, Ba? It looks good. Okay, so what I'm going to do is hang it and adjust it on the door, and then I'll take you outside and show you. I'll be back. Hey guys, as you can tell, I forgot to turn the mic on again, but I brought it outside and hung it on the door. It's a little bit crooked, but I did adjust it uh, a couple of times, so it looks pretty good. I'm quite happy with it, and uh, yeah, so um, that's it. So hopefully, um, you know, you like it and make it your own, you know, you can do your own thing, so. Yeah, and I got to get used to turning on the mics. <laughs> so hopefully next time I'll remember.
thank you guys. Right here, I was explaining on the bar for hooking your wreath on that they have different color ones. Um, I got an orange one from uh, Dollar Tree that I used for Halloween. And then they have green ones for Christmas. I have a silver one or a gold one. I think that's gold. Um, but if I could find one that was red for Valentine's Day, I would hang it with that one. It would make it look a lot nicer. Um, but I haven't been to Dollar Tree lately, so I might stop in tomorrow after in between my job and see if I can find something. Um, that's what I was explaining. And I was talking about the sticky tape there that I used um, behind the love. And that seemed to work pretty good. It was the same color, so it kind of blended in. I don't think you can see it through the O there for love. It looks pretty good. So I'm quite happy. Um, so, yep, that's what I was trying to explain to you. And I can't remember everything else I said. <laughs> so, there you go. There you go. Now I got my mic on. I'm sorry. I'm just not used to having all these equipment, so I got to get used to it. Um, yeah. So, okay. So it's pretty good. Um, let me check here for a minute. Yeah. Okay. We're on. <laughs> anyway, so, yeah. So, yeah, I think it's pretty. Um, yeah, it looks pretty. And you can take, so I could take some of these and move them around if I want to. I could, you know, whatever my mood is. And if I don't want to keep the wreath, you know, I can use them for other projects if I want to. So that's the nice thing about just sticking them in there. But it still took a lot of time. I mean, you know, it, 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 was, a, it was a full day project, you know. I mean, you know, I'd say a couple hours maybe. Because he came and that kind of disturbed everything. So, but uh, yeah, so I think it looks really cute. Anyways, that's it for now. I, we will have, once it gets warmer, it's been very cold here in Florida. And we're not used to it. We're used to warmth. And, I mean, to you all up north, I know it's not a big deal. But it is when you, a lot of people don't have heat in Florida because they don't really need it. And when it gets cold like this, they're really cold. So, I have um, heaters. I don't have um, central heat. So, because I have to... Put a new one in this house because they had stolen it so um we're not gonna do uh, a full unit we're gonna put in the ones that go above your doorway which you'll see when we get them it'll take a little time to get those so anyways you know it's just been too cold to to go boating or fishing or anything so or it's been raining so yeah, we've been staying inside mostly or going to the store and that's about all I've been doing and working. So anyways, so anyways, I hope I hope you all have a good rest of the week. Um, I work tomorrow, so uh, maybe on the weekend I'll get something going and I will get you another video up. And stay tuned for Shea Bear 1000's videos because he has many more coming up. He, he's been a little bit underneath the weather, weather so... As uh, soon as he gets feeling a little bit better. I know he's still trying to put a video up even though he's not feeling good. So make sure you go and visit him. Alright. So y'all have a great, great rest of the week if I don't get back to you. And we'll hopefully see you soon for more videos. So Monkey says she's out for now. Bye y'all.